Properly, and we are live. Welcome back to another game of Tyranny of Dragons, where we have but a few of my players, at least two thirds. That's all we really need. Uh, where we last left off, you guys started on your journey of the roads, where fucking somebody recognized Luca, and you guys pulled off the best laid plan any of my players have ever pulled off. Like you guys rolled well, you had a good plan. It was just murder, murder, murder. Uh, Kenny had a little bit of emotional trauma. All in all, good times. Shit was like Ocean's uh, <laughs> 11? Yeah, it, you guys, like, Kenny it disguises one of his friends, then held him as you get and killed him. Like, it was horrifying. Then you guys followed uh, a white, a golden stag into the woods, which gave you guys a magical weapon and gave you guys like a little, little riddle of sorts. Um, that was a riddle. And not quite a riddle. I'm trying to go back up. Uh, oh, it did say some like prophetic stuff. Yeah. It it was talking about um. I told us to stay on the path. Yeah. Yeah. It, it talked to you. Um. It assured you that you were on the right path and that you must continue the river of gold until you reach the castle in the sky. Sadly, your path will be filled with hardship and blood. And then when you uh, pick up the bow, it faded from the view saying not all will survive. Who grabbed the bow? Yeah, I, I believe you. Right? Yeah, I believe you grabbed it. Also, did I get an item card for that? I was just looking yeah, at Yeah, I should have. Let me see. Boom, boom. I think it is. I think it was... Uh, yeah, it, you you do have one. Uh, boom, boom. Unless that's broken, that might be. But you do have one attached to you in uh, the item tab. In the item tab. Uh, don't know if I can ah. turn off crits on this. Because I know it has a special, unique crit. Yeah, how did I... There it is. Yeah. I just added it to my actual inventory. Okay. Sweet. Oh, uh, okay. Just so we're all, we are all staring at the big map, right? Yes. Yes. Yeah. I just wanted to make sure my game wasn't like froze up or, and I was. Okay. Oh yeah. But uh, yeah, no, your game's not frozen. We're on the big map. I do need to make this so this doesn't crit on you. I believe. I'm gonna make this like fifty so it can't crit. Cause it has the the number crit right, mm -hmm. or when it. Or it quits, but you don't double die. I don't know. We'll have to figure that out more. But. <sighs> As you guys continue down the road. After murdering the guy. People talked about the missing guard. But nobody found him. And as such. They really like. They couldn't stay behind with the caravan. So they continue to move ahead. Ah. Alright, that really that? 
Yeah, that's really that far up. Okay. <laughs> so, as you guys continue forward, I think for the next, like, couple days, it's pretty, like, up to the next week, it's pretty calm. Not a lot happens. No random fights. Like nothing like that. Um, uh, though I think at a certain point, one of the the wagons hit it like the wheel breaks on a rock, and one of the crates tumbles free and smashes open. Full of distortion pieces. Distortion pieces? Displacer uh, beasts? Displacer yes. beasts. Yes, exactly. There you go. 20 of them spawn out of nowhere. Roll initiative. Jesus Christ. 20? <laughs> Holy shit. Uh, <laughs> preemptive self defense. Uh, can we, uh, uh can, can we go up to the whoever's cart it is and. Hey, can we give you a hand with that? And then as I do that, I kind of like look to see if I can check what the contents of it was. Uh, sure. Give me a perception as you're trying to help lip the cart up so they can fit a new wheel on. I'd also try to assist, please. Yep. Perception, you say? Oh. Uh. Legendary stole all of my life. <laughs> yeah, he said he was going to. Uh, I think, Grenadol, you see, um, you're not quite as helpful as Candy getting the car up, so I think you catch a glimmer out of the side of your eye before they, they scoop up, uh, the items. It looks like one of the, the items that fell out of the crate was wrapped in wool, and it looked like a jewel. Oh, shit. Is this, with my passive perception, do it, do it, wait, check something out? Instead of uh, fell out? Uh, you would have noticed that there's a whole bunch of these wrapped and roll items in this thing. Mm -hmm. Uh, but very quickly, the people who run this, uh, this wagon scoops them back into the crate and kind of, like, repackages it up. Uh. Oh, I, I can actually... Go and and try to like offer help, because they can, like uh, cast mending, try to help and fix stuff. Oh, nice. Okay, so you you mend a broken wheel after they got the new wheel on, so that if this happens again, they at least have that spare wheel again. Uh, Canny, you recognize that these. Uh, you recognize that this is one of the caravans that has the cultists on it. Ah, okay. We get back to the group and say, "Did you, uh, did you guys notice who who was the uh, the owners of that cart there?" Uh, no, but I think they're transporting a bunch of treasure. Yeah, there there's a lot of stuff like rolled up, and they're trying to hide something there. Did you guys say that they took a bunch of treasure out of the uh, the cave there that, that where I found you guys? Yeah, I mean, they definitely took a bunch of stuff from the town, and then we didn't find it, so it must be with, oh, yeah. this must be it. Or at least, you know, treasure from somewhere. Dragon cultists with a bunch of gems? Should we go full bandit? And steal the cart and run off into the distance. <laughs> uh, but then that kind of, you know, you didn't hear anything <laughs> identifiable, but I understand what you're saying. You should also, you also remember, uh, Renadol, that your quest was to find out where they're heading. Oh, shit. Right. You fi they figured they'd be transferring stuff like this. This just confirms it for you. But we have divine providence that we're on the right path. And if this is the path that we're on, then isn't this the correct path? 
If you, yeah. if you play stock in what a golden stag might have said. I place all of my stock in what the golden stag said. Follow the golden path. I mean, these are gems, but, you know, maybe the worth is more Oh, shit. Needed. It's literal gold. That That's even more... That makes me even more sense. <laughs> was it actual gold, though, or was it gems? Does it matter? Uh, the thing I saw was, like, gold thing, I think. All right, well, you know, we just track this down. I'm just a little nervous, all right? I'm going to put my cards on the table here. We're following a dragon cult, and they are bringing a bunch of gold to something. What do we know about dragons? Everyone, together now? They fart a lot. They absolutely fart a lot. That is what I was trying to say. Just as another side point, just in case anyone else was curious, I think dragons also like gold and stuff. Oh, yeah, that's true. Do we have a dragon expert in the group at the moment? Uh, I think it depends on the dragon. Some dragons hoard gold, some don't. Yeah, but I mean, like, in general, they like offerings, right? That's true. Yeah, most most of most of them, at least, uh, a lot of the chromatic variety like yeah. being yeah. worshipped. Absolutely. What I'm saying is, I don't see a good dragon, you know, demanding favors from its subjects. You know, someone who's yeah. gonna subjugate that... a group of cultists is probably gonna want some kind of offering like this in a nefarious kind of way. So you think? Our quest to follow them to their destination is going to result in us arriving in the lair of a dragon. Uh, or to the drop-off point of something, you know, like uh, maybe the dragon picks it up at, a, at a, a drop and then takes it to its place so no one knows where it is. Wasn't there a big like blue that. dragon in the battle? You guys saw what? A big blue <laughs> dragon. In the Oh, you weren't there. Uh, hold on, hold the... on, hold on. You guys, you guys saw a blue dragon. Well, like, more than like, saw, we fought it, and won. It's dead. We killed like it. Like a big what? Mm. No, I'm that's a, that's a lie. Sorry, we did. We didn't <laughs> win at all. It breathed on us a couple of times and then left because it got bored. Uh, how <laughs> how big was the dragon? Um. Huge, no, like more, more than that. Big, it was so, big enough. It was adult, a, 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 a probably little... adult sized. Like, okay, so do you think this is maybe who we're delivering it to? Why didn't he just take it with him? What, maybe was the, a different dragon. I didn't see the blue one at the camp though. That's true. Plus. I guess it would make sense for somebody else to carry the loot for him. Be very manual laborious for a dragon. Well, and and just to double check that I'm not going crazy, we've done a lot of stupid shit over the last couple weeks. Repeat this for me: you guys fought and survived a big ass blue dragon. Yeah, but I mean. I think he just got bored and left. So. Yeah, I was just about to say, I think that's a bit glorifying what we did, but yeah. Where, where did this happen? At the castle. At, you know what he's talking about. He's talking about Green Nest Keep. There was a big siege. The dragon was there. There was a... I fought their leader and uh, managed to impress him enough for him to leave us alone because i'm amazing and alive i got this sick ass scar you know what i got a scar I mean, in my eye I, i'm just gonna take your word for it at this point. <laughs> <sighs> but then we I... killed him i think we killed that guy that was the blue guy who might be uh um he, he he was more silver but yeah Sethra might be the guy. <laughs> oh. 
you you flash back to the scene. You guys are fighting this big silver dragon man, tarnished silver. There, there was a, a flash of light, and then when everybody could see again, there was a Sithra dead on the ground and a Sithra standing above the other Sithra. You had Alistair who punched the standing Sithra and then hit the lying dead on the ground one with a hammer, thus making sure that it was dead. And to this day, he still doesn't know if he killed the real Sethra. It was Langdidrosa. Yep. Cyan Wrath, even though he's silver. So that's why you guys had such you a... You remember that. Yeah, my memory is amazing. Mm-hmm. That's why you guys had such a vendetta against that guy. I just kind of thought it was, you know, someone you wanted to take care of, but... Uh... You got a history with this person. Yeah. Then Alistair stole his weapon. All right. Well, I guess we're following this gems, gold, whatever it is, to its destination. Now, at least we know we're on the right track. Yeah, we've got verification. I mean, yeah, we. We had no idea if we were following the right people or, you know, if they even had the treasure. Now we know. That's good. Yeah, yeah. So we're not on, like, a decoy or anything. That's and good. if they if they split up, we know at least this cart. We could follow this cart because it has the treasure. Oh, shit. If, if no, they all split up. I wonder if we can... Because there was multiple cultist little carts kind of spread out throughout the caravan. I yeah. wonder if we can covertly kind of see if there's more of these stashes elsewhere. And then maybe we could, I don't know, could we mark this one somehow? Or mark the ones that we're suspicious of? Um, Mike, do the carts look different enough that we could? Um, I mean, the, all, all of the carts are pretty decently unique. None of them are uniform, so you probably could. Kenny's been looking at uh, at the uh, cult, cult members anyway, so you could probably recognize them and by look. Okay. That way we don't have to risk trying to graffiti their cards. Yeah, yeah. But that but we do hilarious. need to see if, uh, if the other ones have any kind of stuff in it. Hey, that was pretty natural, the way that wheel kind of just crapped out and, you know, spilled apart. Maybe... We could set some traps for the Yeah, cart. yeah, yeah. 100%, you're on the same wavelength as me. I'm loving it. I have mold earth. And you can, like, skitter ahead and, and maybe... Make some traps. Some very natural-looking potholes. Yep. Like we're in Cleveland, Ohio. I've heard of that realm. <laughs> yeah, I hear the roads are terrible. It, it sounds very similar to that other place, which is just kind of north of it. This town of Toronto. <laughs> oh, is the, is the roads bad there too? Horrible, <laughs> horrible. Oh, I sympathize. Um, yeah, I'll go create some... Uh, road hazards and I guess try to place them in a place where they'll be hazardous. Can you point out what carts I should aim for? Well, we, that's what we're trying to figure out, right? We might have to lose Oh, well, I mean, like, because you, you've been keeping an eye on the the suspected cultist cards, Oh, right. right. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. So, target maybe those guys over there, and uh, let me see. Uh, those guys over there. Okay. And uh, okay. two, two carts ahead. Uh, the one more. Yeah, that one there. Oh, yeah, I got it. Got it. My mind is like a trap. Like what you're gonna lay. I see what like, you did there. Yeah. Uh, except not made out of dirt. Um... Alright, Mike, I'm gonna go 
ahead a little bit. I guess I'll turn into a field mouse and scamper around and ahead uh, and try to lay some potholes down strategically placed to try to take out uh, some cultist carts. No, no, not just the cultist carts. That would be suspicious as fuck. Uh, <laughs> like like all of the cart, not all of the carts. I guess just a random assortment of carts, including the cultist carts and other carts. Yeah, we got mending. We're fine. We'll patch people and up. Maybe even our carts to 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 uh, waylay suspicion. Away so from us how are you? How are you setting? Because that's I how am, that works. How are you setting up these traps? Mold earthing potholes. And soft soil. Okay, that'll break and, some. And some wheels. Uh, I am. Uh. Um, looking through my spells. <laughs> um. Do, 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 do. Wow, I have a lot of spells. <laughs> Druid, am I right? <laughs> um. Five? What level? Oh, I don't have third level today. Okay. Um, I don't know what to do. How, Ganny, how do I... How do I lay traps? <laughs> I don't know how your magic works, man. You just, like, Shit. you said you're gonna dig some holes. Dig some holes. And I'm then digging maybe, holes. Like, all right, and then maybe, <sighs> like, if you see, like, I don't know, some leaves or branches around, maybe throw those over so it covers it or some shit. Oh, have it, yeah. Have you seen Renadol talk to people? He digs plenty of holes. I dig so many holes. Um, I just keep funny. digging. <laughs> That's, that was a good one. I award one point of inspiration to the DM for that joke. <laughs> What's the, how much does I, DM inspiration cost? Uh, slightly more than player. I think 750. I don't have too don't much worry. I still, I still have inspiration for the DM from Dom that I didn't use oh. <laughs> on Wednesday. Take it. Take it and run with uh, it, you bad man. <laughs> Hey, I, I plan on saving it until I need it. Um, yeah, I'll camouflage the holes, scatter them down the road for a couple miles, you know. Like okay. it's just a couple miles of potholes. And I'm going to need from bag. you to make a wisdom check for your uh, use of mold earth, mold earth just gotcha. to see how well your holes are. Uh, if you could blind GM that to me, that'd be great. Okay. Blind GM? That Don't I get you... to see no. what the result no. is? No, no, I love it. I love it. Shit. That way you I have to wonder it. whether you did or not. And it's just straight right now. Right. Oh, I heard the roll sound. And then go ahead and give me a s same blind GM, but stealth. And you oh. use wisdom for your stealth too, because you're trying Can to. I cast pass without a trait. No, because you're mold earthing. But I am giving you wisdom instead of dex. Mold earth isn't a concentration. Yes, but you're you're actively covering it as you're molding earth. Right. You said wisdom stealth. Yep. It's blind oh, again. Yeah. Yes. It's better. Um... I hope your wisdom is better than your your Still. dex. One would hope. Okay. So you, a, as you finish up, you get back to the the caravan to meet up at Canny. Canny, you're watching. You start to see some of his holes come into view. He did a really good job digging holes. <laughs> <laughs> experienced <laughs> like yeah <laughs> years and years of practice no they're very good holes and he has them set at such random interv intervals that they don't seem planned he's very good at that uh, for some reason however 
a lot of them are just covered up with leaves and stuff, but the trees are like very far away from the road. And they almost stick out because of the leaves. Hey, I can see you. Oh, shit. I can see you, Doug Holes. Oh, shit. Were you not supposed to be able to see them? <laughs> uh, I'm sorry. I misunderstood the objective. It's all right. Uh, it's all right. Maybe maybe we'll catch a couple of the ones trailing behind. I, just, off I didn't nope. want anybody to break their legs or anything. <laughs> I was worried. Very considerate of you. Very considerate. Uh. Uh, would you like to see what you rolled now that I've described it to you? Now that you no, found... I'll leave it a mystery. Okay. Now just scroll down so you can't cheat and look at the stream then. <laughs> <sighs> but yeah, you do get at least one or two carts that like get stuck in there and need help up. Just because of how packed you guys are on the road. But most can avoid uh, the potholes. Um, I think you get another one of the cultists, uh, caravans, but, or wagons, but I think they don't drop anything or anything this time. Mm -hmm. They got it more bundled down. Oh, well, it was worth a shot. At least we, we still know the one. Do you think, um, that field mouse thing that you were doing? Oh, yeah. You think maybe you could just, you know, go scurry around in their carts? Oh shit, you're right. I could infiltrate their carts. Well, I mean, hold on, hold on. I could eat all <laughs> into their treasure chest. I can go too. Very risky, though. Very risky. No, I like, mean, who attacks a field mouse? It's never gonna happen. Uh, and I would attack I the mouse I was trying to get into my cart. If I'm being honest with you. You're a horrible I did person. that with you twice so far. <laughs> to be honest, you're, you're a horrible person. Only horrible people That's... attack animals. Mm, not a lie. <laughs> Wait, these are cultists. They're definitely horrible people. They're gonna <laughs> attack me. Holy shit. They're definitely gonna attack a field. I mean, they might. You never know until you try. Wait, I feel like you just suggested I do something, and then then you said, no, don't do it. <laughs> I think it was, it was more like, so here's an idea, but don't rush into it. Oh, that's yeah, what I, I got it from. Yeah, there. exactly. Let's make sure that if you're going to do it, you can do it safely. There's Dom Wait, I mean, Prime. We're going to plan? Wow. Like, you know, our last plan went really well. We should do that more often. If we you got you you can do like stealthy things, you can do animal things, if anyone else can help you be a little bit more like less noticeable or something. I Let's could. make sure we really I stack can, you up. But just for a minute though. You can help him out for a minute or you can do the same thing for a minute. No, I I can help him out for a minute. Alright. A minute is I, good. I can prepare Enhance ability. I think is that a yeah. I can it is. I can do enhance ability. Oh yeah, my prepared spells were all fucked up. I didn't I didn't fix that. Need, and I didn't make you a uh, wire chip thing. That's right. We can do that next time. Um, Ping me. Remind me. I can give you like a, my giant shadow hand to to go with you. Oh shit. So. They continued on while you guys are talking, though. Um, yeah. What do you guys want to do? Or do you guys just want to keep an eye on them and proceed with caution? Uh, I think the rest of the day I can probably just be keeping an eye on them. Okay. Because I need to prepare different spells. Yeah, yeah, and you know, not too much heat, right? Like, first the weird traps, and then all of a sudden the mouse is going into their stuff. Yeah. Do we have any idea of how long we have left on our journey? Um... Ten years. <laughs> yeah, no, um... You probably would, but I don't. Off the top of my okay. head. We, I mean, we have a couple days that we can screw around looking for info. 
Yeah. Where are we going? You're going to Waterdeep. Where's Waterdeep? Along this road. That was extremely helpful, thank you. It looks like you're about halfway there. For my uh, nonchalant. What does your map have labels? Our map doesn't have labels. No, you don't see it right here. No. This, this is what. We don't I don't see know why. Any names. I don't know why mine has it and yours doesn't. Why do you get names? Because I'm the DM. This is the That's shittiest fair. map ever. From our perspective, it's Can just buy a map landscapes. <laughs> Can we buy a better map, please? <laughs> I have 500 uh, gold burning a hole in my pocket. I'd like to buy a better map. It's uh, 501 gold. <laughs> but seriously, I, I don't gold. know. I don't know how to make you guys just have icons. I pulled you to the same map. I didn't know there was like DM specific <laughs> on Foundry. <laughs> to be honest. That's absurd. Who did that? The map when I imported it. I'm going to file a complaint with their manager. We can go back to Boulder's Gate and change this to an illicit themed campaign. Oh, shit. We can just you know play what? Baldur's, Baldur's <laughs> Gate 3. Good. Fine. And yeah, they have these tadpoles, and if you put them in your eye, the whole new adventure happens. And then we become... Illithid, we raise an army of Illithid, we attack the Dragon Cult, yeah. and we defeat the yeah. Dragon Cult with an army of Illithid. Spoilers. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> I think at a certain point the next day, uh, you guys, it's not on the map here, even though your map doesn't have names, but you guys are traveling through some small forests that the path just barely can get through. When Alistair, you have a nice high passive perception. I think you notice bit, yeah. movement out front. Uh, guys, there's something happening there. And it's right when you mention that. That Dang it, I don't have a great, like, road... I, I don't want to use the same old roadside map that I've been using. Dude, mm -hmm. it's literally like driving on any highway in the city. Yeah, I know, so exactly. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> uh, so, let me just... Let me view this. Is this one I want? I have two of these, right? Uh, you know what? Good enough. Let me activate this and delete all of the tokens on the map real quick. And then put you guys on our heel. <clears throat> Boom. We've been here before. <laughs> Never. Oh, shit, in circles. <laughs> there's, a, there's literally a red X on the map. <laughs> No. Wait, there's a vest board corpse over there. <laughs> no, wait, what? Is that? I'm fucking with you. <laughs> okay, I thought I left it. Uh, <laughs> I mean, like, I'm pretty sure I deleted all those. Anyway, <laughs> you guys are riding along on the caravan, and, um,. I need to put this on here because this is going to be like one of the caravans. I think I can actually do this. If I'm you know, right. Time. Yeah. Uh, this. And, uh, Why does this bridle have a golf ball attached to it? That, oh, that's Dom's cursor. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> Yeah, he saw your cursor right there. He's like, why is there a golf ball there? Don't, don't mind me. Forget I but asked. The, this is going to be where the caravan is. I'm going to show you with the horse and whatnot. Um, you, let's assume for now that you guys are probably in the caravan right behind this horse. One. 
you guys are probably right back here. Um, you guys see from the wood. This place. Yes. 20 of them. I told you, they've escaped. They're here. <laughs> Stop rolling dice, DM. <laughs> yeah, I don't like being able to hear it. <laughs> don't worry. It. <laughs> don't worry. It's just like also game three. <laughs> <laughs> like, get somewhere and just like rolls, 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 rolls. And from the wood, towards the front. One, yeah. Uh, what the fuck is that? Do those are rolls to determine the number of enemies? No, actually. No, I hate it. I have all of the enemies auto roll for HP, and that's what you uh, guys are hearing. I heard four rolls. No, you didn't. I can promise Shit you. That. Doesn't mean anything. And you heard five rolls. Oh, that was oh, that's gross. Out as added words. From the two sides come two giant spiders. That's disgusting. Uh, I don't like it. <laughs> what the fuck is this picture? I don't know. It is a what? horrifying picture, though. Why is it wet? <laughs> it's glistening. I don't like that. Oh, jeez. Don't make it bigger. <laughs> fuck. Oh, no. Please don't. Oh, no. Uh, Gosh. They are... Harassing and starting to fight with the guards of the first cart. They can have the guards. Fuck. <laughs> I'm going the other direction. Is it a cultist uh, cart? That's, that's good no, advice. it's not. It's one of the non-cultist carts. Oh, all oh, right, shit. all right. So, I get out my new And class, then so. <laughs> also running out with them are these wonderful things. No. This is already bad enough. Oh, these motherfuckers again. Who are running, trying to unclip the horse. These fucking Ew. bastards. Wait, did we fight those? I don't think I fought those. No, I've fought these. And then something else, Mike ran. Oh, it was, okay. It yeah. was a one-shot. Yeah. I have. Like, I, I know I've... But not in this game. Okay, cool. I fought them in, uh... Something recently. Um... Snappers are gross. Why do they exist? I use, I use them in uh, a dream one shot as like a deep fear of of, <laughs> uh, of one of my players. Oh, no. Uh, oh yeah. no. Nah, this one. I need this one. Nah. Nah. Ugh. Ugh. Yeah. Okay. So these will be the two guards that they're harassing. I don't like this encounter. Mike's generous. I had driders with these guys as backups. <laughs> no, I did in the one shot too. Yeah. Oh shit. It, there was an ice drider or something. Was that what it was? No. There was, a, there was uh, something to do with ice. I remember no, you. I. No. Anyways. <laughs> Am I just remembering wrong completely? Yeah, a hundred percent. There was what you were maybe remembering is how the face spiders looked. Maybe. Probably. I need you guys to roll for initiative. I don't want to. I'm not participating. Okay. When a dog chooses to be a... Can I just a... go first? Oh, I got a 20. Uh, I mean... I want to be honest with you, Alistair. You can't. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna be here for a while. <laughs> <laughs> My curse continues. Kelly, can I have initiative? Do, do I see it? Mouse moving? Kelly. Sethra. Wake up. I am. Um... I don't see his light purple, so it's off doing something. Um, so I guess this will be for you three. <laughs> Shit. It's fine. 
Those guards oh, they are do. level 15 champions, right? So, start of turn one. Champion. Yeah, exactly. Uh, starting turn one, this other cap is just trying to, uh... Oh, there's Kelly. And then I change Rizak to be right after him. I think guard stat blocks are like quarter CR or something. Okay, so the other cap is right out, uh, like it's trying to unhook the harness to the horse. And that's what he's doing his turn. This one is trying to keep the guard busy, so he's just going to attack them. Uh... That, God damn it, Spider, why are you trying to disappear on me? Run a doll. I wanna magic surge. Okay, what Please. spell are you casting? Um, There's no way this could go bad like it did for Corey on Sunday. Uh, what happened? Uh, he has exactly one vocal, like non-vocal semantic spell, and that's counter spell. And Wild Magic said put pink bubbles coming out of his mouth every time he tried to talk. Oh, that's... that's so he tough. couldn't use any vocal semantic components. Oh, jeez. Let's hope this goes better than that. Um, I am doing my my go-to uh, um, fire ball sphere. There it is. I don't right. have any second level spell slots. You oh, should I have. haven't. I haven't long rested. Yeah, you should have long rested before this. Go ahead. My bad. All right. Where's there's the spell? Cast spell. You do wired magic surge, so go ahead and place that, roll damage, and then. Oh, it didn't. I fucked it up. What would you like it? The ping? Uh. I guess. Uh. Remember, you can put it, it on things to make them roll. I'm gonna ram it into the guy who's trying to unhook the horse. Go ahead, hit damage. Um. Thank you. Not an issue. That, that was a really good roll. Just double sixes. Yep, and I need for you to roll that mag wild magic surge table. Oh, yeah. Uh, where? Down to tables. Rollable tables. Feats. No, it's it's under it's tables under rollable tables. Not rollable tables under rollable tables. Yeah. It's Even specific. though it's a rollable table. Shush. <laughs> what do I press? Oh, there it is. That's a lot. What's it say? Who? Who? Up to Within three characters, feet? you choose up to thirty feet. Thirty feet. How far is 30 feet? Shh. Hell yeah. One. Two. Oh, up to three. So I can do the two yes. um, boys. Yep. Perfect. That's fine. Hell yeah. Clutch a kick moment right there. And then I have movement. Damn. 5, 10, 15. As you guys see lightning crackling on Renadol. 20. I'll stay there. Um, actually, no, I don't want to be that far forward. Over here is fine. All right, end turn. Um, this one just got struck with lightning, so it's going to... Uh... It was the horse. Obviously. It's a magical lightning horse. Uh, 
That's a zero. <laughs> He no, no, why would he hit the horse? Shit. What have I done? Oh my gosh, he's gonna kill the horse. Yeah! What he... have I done? That's what I get for talking. <laughs> he thought it was the horse! Can we resurrect the horse if it dies? Do you have any resurrection uh, magic? I need a trigger yeah. warning for this. Encounter. If the horse dies, I'm gonna be triggered. Get the nice one. Uh, this other cat uh, hurt his friends more than. So let's see. Setha! There's people who need your help. That was a good test, by the way, that I could start initiative and just have people roll initiative whenever they get there. That's good to know. Yeah, that's convenient. Um, we want to do that. No wait, am I? I might have to step closer, but I think you would have to step off to the side, but you'd be fine, just so you can hit it without hitting the horse and cart, because there's technically a cart right here. It screeches out in pain. <laughs> I think um, I'm just gonna throw my other one at it. Can you throw two of them at this level? You're only level four. Um. Does no. the dual wielding bonus action attack count for thrown weapons? I don't think so. That makes sense. But he does have a bonus action he can use. Bite. That would be what. That's what he was thinking I'm of like, doing. Wait, yeah, I'm like, no, I'm like, I know I have two attacks that I can do at the moment. It Slap is. My other one is. <laughs> telling a Wizak to stick nuts. <laughs> <laughs> we all just cringe a little bit. <laughs> cringe damage. <laughs> no. Psychic damage rebounds throughout the rest of the party. Where, where would you like him, Kelly? I can see he can move all the way up here. I think if you press space when you try to do that, it, it might be a wall. That's why it was acting up. Oh. Uh... So, these trees kind of are hard to get around and whatnot, so... Go ahead and roll for Rizak's stuff. Unfortunately, an 8 does not hit. But it is a wonderful rogue's turn, canny. Uh, geez, this looks pretty bad. I'm gonna move up over here. He says uh, it's one of them is almost dead, the other one is dead. Just yeah. don't end your turn within five feet of my f f fireball. Yeah, I'm gonna be safe over here, right? And then I'm gonna yeah. look at this, uh, uh, the two big spiders are not hurt. That's kind of on its you way have, You have a lot of, yeah, I remember what you were telling me now. You poor bastard with that spell list. Yeah. I took a look at it. I'm like, I'm not looking at Flame and Spear. I'm not going through that. <laughs> I can um, post it if you want. No, I, it, Ste it's good. Steady aim means I don't move, right? You cannot yeah, move you whatsoever. 
Yeah, okay, so I can't do that. I already moved. But I I'm will say the gods are considered allies. Nice. Oh, fucking sweet. All right, so I'm going to sharpshooter uh, this first little guy over here. How do I target again? There we go. I know it's been a little bit down, but jeez. <laughs> I missed. Oh. I Four? Missed. How? It, it, because he sharpshooted. Oh, I forgot immediately after you said it. If it makes you feel better, Dom, you would not have hit after sharpshooter and, like, before sharpshooter either. That's yeah, it good. was a, just a bad roll. Yep. All right. Uh, that's an action. Bonus action. I blame Legendary. <laughs> Always. Uh, bonus action, bonus action, bonus action. Mastermind. Yeah, Alistair, I don't know what you got planned, but I bet it's going to be real cool. So take this as a boost of confidence, all right? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I really want you to, Luca, just dodge and pass your turn. Like, I don't want to get closer. Those are spiders. <laughs> <laughs> Hell no, I'm not getting close. I don't know what gun is on about. <laughs> <laughs> that that was the DM talking. I didn't whisper it as your friend. You're fine. <laughs> what's he funny is how many times. What's funny is how many times I do whisper him about stuff with you guys, and you guys never know. Mm-hmm. Use your action to hide. You'd have advantage. Okay, now that it's this giant spider's turn. Fucking spider. Oh shit. The guard's living another day. Man, if only this was Boulder's Gate. Like, Boulder's Gate, these spiders would have a bonus action web attack. Oh. It's ah, the most shit. I OP shit Sorry. ever. I can't use the help action on Alistair because he's not near someone. I have to help someone that's near uh, someone. Uh, oh. You could have done it on one of the guards or on Rizak. <laughs> yeah. Uh, the Whatever guard is up next. This... This... Uh, it doesn't matter. I don't know which one's up next. I'm helping a guard. The one the, that's closest to me. The one whose turn it currently is. is yeah, yeah. Up yeah. next. Go for the underbelly. It looks really soft. Does it? He, he's going to try to listen to you. And stab with advantage. Wow. Oh. Put some chutzpah it's... into it. You gotta, you gotta <laughs> want to hit it. He won't have use... wanted it to. <laughs> you gotta use your hips more. Don't just thrust with your shoulders. Oh gods! Anisha just goes like running and Renato and Kenny can hear him while he's running, passing through them. More like I hate this, I hate this, I hate this, I hate this. Why do you have to be spiders? And I'm gonna run right. Uh, shit, no, that's 35 now. Alright, uh, that's okay, I can go here. So I run here. And I'll... <clears throat> I'll get like a... A, a, a very small, like, uh, ball of something flammable and just throw in the ground and it just bursts out and I'll cast Halo of Flames. Targeting oh. those two. Only. Which two? This one. Yep. Uh, Castell. <laughs> and, and I can choose. You can hover over them and hit T, I believe, to untarget. Uh. Okay. Yeah. Here. Here. There's a way, like shift click. Or, yeah. Yeah. Both. Yeah. Control T. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, that looks... 
The ring of fire ignites above your head and then springs outwards, coming to rest in a burning circle. The circle is compi uh, like composed of a five foot wide line of flame. Each creature you choose within the area must make a deck save. Wow, that definitely reads like they wouldn't have a choice. Mm -hmm. uh, but they both fail and take the 13th fire damage. Which I did not roll so well, but okay. Yeah, 46 and you got... Uh, I mean, to be honest, you rolled... Slightly above average. Uh, slightly below average? Because I think average on the... Yeah, I would say slightly below average. By like one. Anyways. And then and it disappears, I guess. It doesn't yep. stay there. When you end your turn, it should disappear. Okay. <clears throat> and yeah, that's my action. And as a bonus action, I'll cry because I'm in the midst of so many spiders. <laughs> okay. Uh... This one sees somebody nearby. By the way, uh, Luca, do you know what this creature is? I have no idea. Well, let me pull up the artwork for you. Oh, no. It's like spider. I don't know if it's better because it's humanoid or it's worse because it's humanoid. <laughs> well, either way, it's going it's to, horrible. uh... Die. Please. <laughs> uh, I believe this is probably what I want to do. Does this have the tackle set up right? It does. Okay. It's going to spit a little web between its two hands and it's going to try to get the web up and basically garage you. Oh, jeez. Jesus Christ. Oh, God. So. Now, as of right now, you are effectively grappled. Why grappled like this? You cannot breathe. Like, it is around your oh, neck. Oh, that's fun. And I can speak too, right? Nope. Which means any verbal some, uh, components, you cannot do. That's fine. That's like all my spells. Yeah, 100% all my <laughs> That is all it can do with its turn. Win a doll. Okay. Um. <laughs> you see Alistair gripping at his neck, which has web around it. As this uh, thing is like on his back, like pulling. Hang in there. You're doing great. Um. Um, I'm gonna, uh, use my action to throw how what, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. I'm 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. Click control. There. If you keep holding down, holding down the control when you click, you'll leave waypoints and space to travel. Um. How do I cancel there? It's cool. Um. Look at okay. Michael being all tech savvy. So. I'm gonna go home. <laughs> home. That's a good idea. <laughs> um, He's trying. Here. He has to succeed the campaign first. Space. There we go. Um, and throw a fire hand ball at bolt. Mm, produce flame. Ah, oh, okay. At uh, the guy who's near death. T. Okay. T. Um. 
attack. Can I have a reaction from I guess Alistair could? My good pal. Actually, um, Alistair's yeah, currently good. choking. I don't think he really can. Well, oh, I mean... Like... <laughs> He's a little He's preoccupied, him. yeah. Just kick him in the butt. I think right. I think Alistair's a little preoccupied. That's fair. I hit. That's good. Is he still alive? Gosh. Yeah. Fucking damn it. Alright. Well... I'm gonna keep attack. Bonus action, move my thing. I bet you're good. Um, <laughs> how do I? Oh, I love flaming spear now. I used it in Baldur's Gate and put it in a doorway, and nothing could get through it. Oh, I don't have control oh, no. of the sphere. That's the issue. Ping. Uh, cause cause I fucked it up. Um, I'm just I'm uh curving it over the horse with my thirty feet of movement with it to hit the guy who's about to die. And then where would you um, like it to end? Um, here. Okay. So go ahead, re-roll damage. Just a moment. Where's my damage button? Why don't... Oh, there it is. Oh, we failed! And I only rolled five. I'm glad he failed. Hell yeah. All right. Uh, that was everything. End turn. I... Weird. All right. I wanted to take care of him because he was going next. And he was near death. So I figured killing him was the optimal strategy. Hmm. Why is there a bike? wall here? Because it's the tree. It's just, it's just a bush. It's, it's a, a tree. full tree. It's a tree. We can see underneath the branches. So, this thing is choking you out, Alistair. I think the guards are going to try to help you. Be right back. Yeah, he, he's going to try to make an athletics to pour it off of you. And fail. Nope. Can I roll a G100 to see if Addister is just like developing a, a <laughs> choke kink? <laughs> I, that, I think that's between you and your god, whoever that may be. <laughs> There you go, Kelly. Moving to get a better idea. Yep. Nice hit. I was just about to say, I kind of did booty for damage, but... I mean, 11's not bad. That's middle of the die, honestly. Oh, wait. Wait, I can Oops. add... Um... Reaction, I believe. Yeah. Well, his, reaction yeah, for his... Yeah, it's reaction for an extra D6. It's a infused strike. Yep. That's what it's called. An extra three damage. And since his turn is next, he gets his reaction back. Did he go under this tree? 
He can. Okay. <clears throat> Just don't end your turn next to the fire. Okay. I have to get Wizard X Cage back up. I think I think he'll be fine if he does. Fifteen hits. Once again, I don't know why Vizak doesn't actually damage these things. Well, we'll figure that out. The way his bite roll stuff is different than... Yeah, I think it's because he might be an NPC. Yeah, he's an NPC, that's why. But my NPCs roll perfectly fine against each other. That's what's weird. I might have yeah. to just remake Rizak. Something's funky. I don't know. Anyways, is... Yep. Put Rizak back. Uh, he's... The spider and him are going to make an attack of opportunity. Spider's going to try to bite and miss. And then he's going to try to claw and miss. Okay. Thank you. And that's his turn. Go ahead, Canny. Show us why they call you Uncanny Canny. Yeah, yeah, Kenny's nervous. Um, all right, maybe, maybe sharpshooter wasn't such a good idea. Maybe I'm just gonna creep up on this guy and hit him normally. Whoop! Sneak attack is Alistair's right there, being choked. Oh shit! Um. I was just being choked. To, to help him out would be like an action. Um, you could try an athletics to break him out, or you can kill the thing choking him, and then he could just get it out himself. Yeah. Oh, it's it's still attached to him? Yeah, it's literally, it's, it's garot wiring him, basically. Oh, shit. And you have two crossbows now, so you could do to him. Well, if I, I should take that feat, shouldn't I? I had it originally. Um... Okay, let's just shoot him. Oh, that's right. That is part of the feed, isn't it? It hits. But now I gotta check. Oh, I forgot this does a lot more damage. That's awesome. Uh, no, the dice did not match. All right. Uh, did it add sneak attack? It did. Uh, you feel white off your shoulders, Alistair, as the web loosens up and the creature on your back falls to the ground. <sighs> and now that it's over... Okay. <laughs> and only Alistair will know. What the fuck was that for? <laughs> uh, is this a really big rock? Uh, and probably not as big as the giant spiders. Uh, any chance I could hide behind it? You can try. They're not exactly looking at you, so. All right, I will bonus section hide. Want to stealth for that? Yes, please. Yeah, I I, like, if... oh god. <laughs> Jeez. I'm pretty confident about that. <laughs> I become a rock crab. Stealth <laughs> is. Can't I can see him. <laughs> Gone. No. Uh, in the future, though, um, something I want to do is stealth roll private, like I did earlier, because I think oh, that oh, would yeah. be hilarious. You think oh, you're yeah, super you stealthy, know. and then it just turns and looks dead at you. <laughs> Makes total sense. Uh, so those are private GM rolls. Yeah. Uh, blind GM roll. Blind what, GM roll, okay. So private means me and you can see it. Blind GM roll means only I can see it. And self roll means only you can see it. Interesting. Uh, but that's and your Alistair turn. Alistair rolls as means no one knows what it is. 
Uh, yeah, uh. end my turn. Sorry. Oh, spider. Um, it sees some trouble. It's gonna try to get at least. It's gonna try to at least get one meal. Oh, Jesus poor, Christ. poor guy. He almost made it. It's gonna grab that and try to run. Oh no, it's not. Oof. Why is his blood pink? It's trying to drag it. Uh, because uh, I believe in the Danganronpa style, well, uh, that's probably 5, 10, 15, 20, uh, that's pr I'll say you can move five more feet and then it's good. Alistair, one of the spiders is leaving, but the other one is harassing another god. I'll just look behind it to to everyone and say, you guys got it, right? And I'll run. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. I'll be right there. And I'll make this weird-ass pose with both uh, hands up, like a, like a Vogue magazine character. <laughs> As my shadow gets up in the same, like, in the same pose, but slightly <laughs> bigger. And uh, it, it but, you, but you guys can't tell that Luca likes uh, JoJo's, huh? <laughs> and Alka's okay, spiritual weapon is a uh, very low music starts to... And I, it will appear right here, this shadowy weird version of me with a uh, hand missing. And <laughs> as you guys can see, my shadow has like... Uh, the the only shadow that that is appearing for me right now is just like this this one disembodied hand as a shadow. What? <laughs> uh, this gets better okay. and better every time. <laughs> I can assure you that neither Mike nor I knows what the fuck is going on with Alistair. So that's okay. <laughs> I know a little bit that he doesn't know, but yeah, go ahead and make an attack roll as you summon it. You hit? Hell yeah. That's a lot of damage, too. And as an action, I would just, like, make the same move with my... What do I have again? It's, uh... uh it's a spear. With my, my, my spear and shield. Uh, attack. Nice. Not a. Why did I took die? Did not took damage. <laughs> it took damage. Yeah, I, I can attack. <laughs> I saw it happen. <laughs> <laughs> and I just like be on guard, waiting for it to to try and attack me back. Do you get my, like... my my shadow versions there? Just like flexing, making <laughs> weird. <animals. laughs> Don't you get to like leave it in the spider or something? Isn't that a thing? Uh, only, only in Pike if I mode. have the other. Yeah, I, I can turn it into a glaive and then I can do that. Oh, you I... spear and shield mode. I said before that every time I pick it up, it's in the spear and shield, so I need to. It's an action or a bonus action to, to change it. Oh, okay. Oh, it's my turn. Sorry. Um. <laughs> uh -huh. Jojo's. Um. Uh, I'm gonna. I can't see shit. I'm gonna. I can't go through the tree. It's okay. I'll go over here first. Um. Stand in front of this good boy. Uh. Use my bonus action to move the flame. Uh, behind the spider, I'll have it end like over here. Um, ram it through. Let me do the damage. So fun fact: you could turn off the fire damage on Baldur's Gate, and I thought that was a ram. So I'm like, why is it not doing damage here? I turned off the fire damage of it. 
Oh, so why is this roll so bad? Oh, I didn't it's target. Shh, that point. Shit. It's not dealing fire damage. Hold on. Just it, it's a glowing it, ball? It's not glowing at the moment. It's just a rock at that point. <laughs> Uh, okay, so nine damage. Uh, and then I'll use my action to throw some more fire at him with my bare hands. You wide shaped again, I knew it. No. You said bare hands. No. I mean, you chose to be here, Michael. You knew what no. this entailed. No. As it sailed over and hit your ball of fire. And turn. Um. Um. I think. What are you doing? Leave me alone! Oh, he's using a recharge ability. What's happening? I don't like this. Target somebody else. Critic, you bitch! Of There's course no... you would critically hit me. <laughs> There's no damage, and technically it wouldn't be a crit because it would have to be another. <laughs> <laughs> Mike, you have you 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 always crit crit me. <coughs> Actually, <laughs> <laughs> I swear you have a toggle switch you can turn on. You have to. You must. I really don't. <laughs> That's insane. So Lucky you for you. You have to fucking. You have to confirm <clears throat> it or something. No, that was disadvantage. He was next to an enemy. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. There's no damage though. You are covered with web. You are restrained. Oh, wow. It's a usual Friday night. <laughs> As it runs away. I was debating. Yeah, I think it does. It grabbed one of the edda caps at your feet and it dragged it away. Oh shit. Zero loyalty. Get that Just opportunity attack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go for it, buddy. Stab him in the bo <laughs> booty. Now, why are you hitting Renadol? That's not what I want. I'll uh, apply the yeah. damage properly. It it's deals four, <laughs> four damage to this man. <laughs> Not to you, Anadol. But he is effectively off the map. He ran into a woods again. This guard, I think, is going to get down here and help you out, or try to help you out of the web. I'm very sticky. Careful. Uh, what's your name? Jack? Jonathan. It, what was that one name that I gave you guys? Xavier? Jaminiah. I think Xavier. Dom, do you remember that random one you impersonated? Oh, gosh. No. I think it was Xavier. Did you just get another crit? Yeah! And what? he got you free of the web. You're supposed to turn off the toggle after you're done hitting me. <laughs> I would have look it twenty one above that. Oh yeah, you're right. Mike doesn't have karmic dice on. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> uh, but that's his turn, getting you out of the web. I'm like, damn, dude, you're real fucking strong. Holy shit! No, he just he used his, he used his spear to cut you out. Ow! You know, with the pointy end. Stabbed um, me a little bit. Sethra. Yeah, well. Maybe that prevents for you stabbing his friend in the neck. You thought he didn't know. <laughs> no, he doesn't. It's fine. As far as you know. So we're going to kill this fucking thing that Alistair's got cornered, right? 
technically done it. He can still leave. What does a tree do? Is it a spear or javelin? They should be using probably javelins. Uh, javelins are d6 thrown, so are spears. I think they're both the same, but javelins have to be thrown while spears can be used in melee. Yeah. Javelins are lighter. One of the silliest distinctions in weapons. What? Javelins and spears? Yes. And in video games, you can stack javelins. Yep. You can't these, stack spears. At least give, like, the javelin a longer range or something. Yeah. Nope, same range. I know, like... It's a like, lot cheaper. Javelins are a lot cheaper. Yeah, but I mean... So there's that. And I'm gonna send Wizak over there. Okay. Wizak, go ahead and try to move over there. Did you say it like that? Because <laughs> his movement's not long enough to get over there. I'm like, he's going to dash, though, to Harry. Nip at the heels. Way. That's a body! Yep. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, he's, he's joking because that's where the I left the body that the spider was dragging away. No respect. That was Jeremiah. He died valiantly. I thought I was Jeremiah. Oh, what? You said your name was... <laughs> Alexander? What What did you say it was? It, started with a, it has Z in it. So Kenny pops up from behind this rock, looking to shoot. He was so fucking well <laughs> hidden that he had no idea what was going on with the battle. So he pops out, ready to shoot, like, over here somewhere. And then, like, realizes half of the battle is completely changed. So he gets <laughs> bearings again, and he retargets this one far away. Uh, so with advantage, he's going to use... Uh, actually, here's the issue, though. It wouldn't be at advantage. Why? Because you uh, have a ra you ha Oh, yeah, you ignore short range. Never mind. Yeah. At advantage, uh, hit 12, does not hit with a 12. Damn, Damn, dude. Damn. Oh, I didn't Get target it either. Sorry, Get didn't mean to do damage. Get good. It, why? 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 <laughs> Make it hit. Make it hit. <laughs> um, bonus action. I, uh, uh, Alistair, do better than what I did. <laughs> <laughs> Not hard. And I'll end my turn because I'm sad. <laughs> Ooh, my sphere. It's just close enough. Does it have a 35 range? 30. And you can't ram it, right? Oh, do I have to actually get it? I don't know. For that? I don't know. It's up to you. Good DM. We'll find out as it is going to... Uh... Try to web Alistair and run away. Yeah. Uh, reaction shit. shoot up. Nice. And reaction attack. I don't think this actually counts as an attack roll. I know it's making a attack roll. Oh, no. Yeah, it's okay. You're right. Shit. Yeah. Technically, I don't even know if it should be making a attack roll. because it says... Uh, the target is restrained, so I'm assuming it has to make an attack roll to rev you, is what it's set up to do, which is fine. So it probably does count for your shields up thing. Discharge. So go ahead. Okay. Uh, make an attack with the screen shield. 
I got lost. Yeah, targeted. Yeah, attack. Hey, you hit Ooh. it. Hello, <laughs> I surprised you were. Do you have sentinel? The no. web is a ranged weapon attack. Yeah, I figured as much. That's why I'm like, it oh, okay. probably counts for that. Uh, and it's going to drop its prey that Rizak is standing on. <laughs> And run away. Oh, what a bitch. Uh, reaction? Um, no, he used that. Does Rizak have a reaction? Rizak could. Rizak has not used it yet. Attack! Bite him in the butt! Sorry, Thorax. Rizak has Sentinel, right? <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> uh, Kelly, Rizak... you, you attacking? Totally has Sentinel. I remember him taking it at level 4. Unfortunately, Vizak doesn't get feats like you guys. What? Well, he has four of them. <laughs> I was about to say it. <laughs> okay, so. Uh... <laughs> oh, God. Oh, he missed. Shit. That's good. I had to roll it. I, I rolled it because I'm like, I'm not going to let it m miss out. I don't think the spider can run through the spiritual weapon. It 100% can because it's a serial. <laughs> Chase no, it down! In Baldur's Gate, all my enemies seem to attack my spiritual weapon. It's very funny. <laughs> Even though it doesn't have it. No, it does it's have HP because it has its does own it turn. HP? It has its own turn and everything. What are they doing in that game? Drugs. <laughs> I don't know how do I how do I move my my spiritual weapon? You have to switch to the uh, ruler tool. The oh, the other ruler tool. Go ahead and point where you want it. With it, it can only move twenty feet away, though. Yeah, it's right, right. It's there, right here. Oh, Try right here. Five, Ooh, ten, fifteen, twenty. Yeah. Oh shit! Half. Oh yeah, me and my shadowy duplicate just go at it. <laughs> I point you guys back to the gifts and chat. <laughs> uh, it's this attack. So your bonus action is right. to... to move and attack it. Yeah. Well, I, I yeah. was just uh, think uh, earlier you'd mentioned you thought it might be an action to switch your weapon, but it's a bonus action. Oh, yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. And I'll attack with spiritual weapon. We thought it to me a spell slot. Do not place nothing. Yes, spell. Place a attack. second spiritual weapon. Nice. Hell oh, yeah. You killed it. Take that, spider. Does that cure? Our fear of spiders. I doubt it. That's not how fears typically go. But you know, by killing, killing what we fear uh. cures us of our fear of it. Is there a dead guard on the ground here? Yeah, there, there is a dead guard right about here. I cast revivify on him. Uh, can we attempt any kind of like medicine check? Yeah. Does he does he have death saves? Can I Typically NPCs do not have death saves. That's right. NPCs don't have death saves. But he's named. He's he's what was it? Yeah. Craig? <laughs> <laughs> he has a name. He's a person. He's a real Okay. If you have one guess to recall his name and if you do you can use healing wood. Xavier. I don't think you were supposed to guess. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm waiting for Michael. What's Xavier. No, Xavier was over here. He's the one Shit, that cut Dom, you out. You suck. <laughs> Fuck you, Dom. You, you named this guard Jeremiah. I did? Shit. You did. Damn it. Damn it, Dom. I was going to guess Jeremiah. Don't you Sadly, you got to him too late. Your, your healing would not have any effect. Oh, poor Craig. 
<laughs> we, we go over to, to Xavier and say, Jeremiah, your friend Xavier was a brave soul. <laughs> <laughs> he fought valiantly. Do you do you do you know if Craig had any family or people who want to? You, you guys can stop helping now. It's okay. Oh, okay. We'll leave the rest to you. Well, oh, wow. I guess you didn't like your fellow guardsmen. Then, <laughs> okay. Yeah. Jeez. I feel bad for Craig. <laughs> and with that, I think it's a nice point to end a short session for today. Nice. Thank you, Mike. I hope you guys have fun. Thank you, everybody who came in to chat. I had fun. Good stuff, man. Good stuff. Uh, making people smile, that's all I want to do here. So I'm glad we did. Uh, I'm doing stream now. We should be live with something on... Actually... I might not be live till Monday. I don't have D&D &D on Sunday, so it's weird. Either way, I'll see you. Have a good one.